it's me Audra Rowdy Girl and welcome back to my channel if you're new welcome I hope by the end of this you feel like subscribing and hitting the notifications bell and also giving this video a big thumbs up if you like it so the noise you hear is Bo playing a fun game of find the treats all right guys so I'm here with a stitch fix but before I get started with that I did want to follow up on a few things with you so the first is the wine so <laughs> normally I would be drinking it, but I already drank it. So the Cocomero was actually really good. This was a rosé. And I guess it was supposed to have a watermelon aroma. I don't know what it really smelled like. It just smelled good. It was tasty. It was tart. And it had a right amount of sweetness. It does pack a punch with a 12.5% alcohol by volume. So it was pretty intense, but this is a summer treat of choice in Italy, and it takes a fresh California approach to a classic rosé. This perfectly pink, luscious rosé reveals a refreshing watermelon aroma. Further indulge your senses by scratching the watermelons on the front label. Oh, I didn't do that. Sit, sit and enjoy. So I'm going to do that and see if it really does smell. I can't tell if I'll know, though. Oh, my God, they do smell. This is the business what but i've also thought about trying a different wine subscription as well besides wink because i thought it would be fun i'm sorry you're all up in my nostrils but i thought it would be fun to try something different because i'm always doing wink and so i was like you know there's got to be other ones so i gotta try them mm. that's some good coffee so the other thing i wanted to follow up with you on was the giaja goat's milk cream um, I don't know if you seem to notice, but I feel like I'm aging backwards. Like, look at my skin. It actually does a really good job of setting where my makeup is. Like, it doesn't, it's, it's not greasy. I thought it had a little bit of a greasy texture, but it's actually not that greasy. And it ends up, my makeup sits really well on top of it. It's better than a primer to me. So those are those. I'll be right back. I have to get a little bit more sugar for my coffee. Okay, sorry about that. So yeah, this is, so far, I have been loving it. I've just been using it in the morning, and it's just been doing fantastic. I mean, I haven't had any problems with it. I have not had any skin breakouts, no weird zits, no bumps, nothing. So, hooray. All right, now on to what we came here for. The Stitch Fix. I am so excited to have this. I actually started scheduling them this time because I thought it would be a little bit better. And this time I had asked for a few things, maybe if I could get them again, and if I couldn't, it was okay. So we will see if I got them. And from there, I'm gonna go ahead and read the card first because I haven't heard from Alyssa in so long. So let me see what's going on. What? What happened to Alyssa? My feelings hurt. It says, hooray, it's fix day. Hi, Audra. My name is Christy, and it was my pleasure styling your 27th fix for you today. Do you have any upcoming holiday events that you need specific items for? Let me know. We are always happy to help you look and feel great. I love your boho vibe on your Pinterest board. I noticed from a previous fix that you wanted to try a jumpsuit, so I pulled this Kaylee Knit jumpsuit. I can definitely see this paired with your denim just jacket USA from fix. That was hard because it's your denim just USA jacket from fix number 25. Next, try these Vigos brand distressed jeans. I see that you might be more of a zero zero in jeans now, so be sure to let me know how they fit. We do carry zero zero, but my phone is ringing. Hold on. Sorry about that. <laughs> She said, I see that you might be more of a zero zero in jeans now, so be sure to let me know how these fit. We do carry zero zero, but my inventory was low for this fix in that size. Pair them with the fabulous boho style Daniel rain top and layer with your new August Miss Cargan. Have a great weekend, Audra XO Christy. Okay, so first of all, let me say I don't like change. I don't know what happened to Alyssa. I said I wanted my same stylus. Oh, he didn't get my same stylus. I don't know what to do with my <sighs> Okay, drama over. I'm so crazy. We're gonna see what what, what Miss Christie did here. All right. I'm worried that because I didn't buy anything that they. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. 
All right, so I am excited that they do have zero zero because I love a Vygos jeans, but I like have not been able to stay in any and I got some. And these are pretty cute. They do have the stretch, which I'm always slightly worried about, but we're gonna see what's up. And then I have the frayed hem. And I wanted to go ahead and show it to you here just in case I don't do a good enough job in my filming. And then the distressing, which I love the distressed knees. And then I also hate it because I hate, I said, I've said this before, I hate getting my toes stuck in it. Because you're always in a rush sometimes when you're putting these on. I don't know why you're always in a rush, but you always are. And you just like break off half of your toe. And then it's just, it's sad. All right. So those I'm looking forward to. Next up, wow, wow. Wow, this is a lot of material. Whoa, girl, whoa. All right. Whew, it fell out of my hand. It's so silky. Okay. So this appears to be the jumpsuit. This is the front of it. I am not positive about how I'm feeling about it until I have it on. But I am liking the material because I feel like it's warm enough for winter, but I'm not positive until I have it on. This is it. This is the girl. We're going to be making out. I don't know why I said that. That was really weird. I also want to let you know while I'm in the middle of like grabbing all this stuff. While I pre-film, we've just hit peak season at work. So my editing and uploading schedule is going to be off for the next month or so. So please stick around and bear with me. But it is going to be a little off. Next up, I have, oh my God. It even matches my background, hose. Why did I call you hose? I'm sorry. It's because I call my best friend, bitch. Sorry. But <laughs> look how cute that is. I'm loving it. Because seriously, okay, so here's the thing. Right now, I think I've discussed this. It, it hasn't quite like wintered yet, and I don't know if it's going to winter. I hope it winters. So those kind of things are perfect for me, and they're also great for going out. I like those. Finally, oh, uh, uh, oh my God, it feels, I mean, it feels like a foot warm. It, it feels like a teddy bear. Y'all, this feels like a teddy bear. It feels like a teddy bear. That's all I can say about this. Like, I can't even show it to you because I'm like, uh, okay, so <laughs> here's the cardigan. I'm such a weirdo, and I'm so sorry, but it feels exactly like like a warm like a towel or like just it feels like a teddy bear like it's like can't wait to try this on for you guys i am so stoked all right so i'm gonna come back after i've tried everything on let you know my thoughts and feelings on everything and we'll go from there here we go <laughs>
All right, guys, this, whew, I was so afraid of change, and I still want to know what happened to Alyssa. I hope I didn't lose her. I want to use both. Can I use both? I'm going to try that. So, so this is really a five for five for me, which it hasn't been in a long time. Like, there's been pieces where I'm like, I like that one. But the thing is, the total for all of it is $276 minus my buy all discount of $69, which gives me a total of 207, which I am fine with. <laughs> While I am being economical, I feel like all of those things fill a space in my closet. So the jeans, I do need jeans to wear. I am literally down to ugly work jeans <laughs> and then one, maybe two pair of cute jeans that I can wear out. And the two pair, one of them is actually a good pair. And the other one's like, I can get away with it if it's dark enough. And then the Daniel Rain top was just so cute. It was very, very comfortable. I loved the way it fit. I loved the way it flowed. And I hope that it showed up as well because I'm kind of doing this back-to-back -back thing. I'm breathing hard because I've started moving Bo so that I can actually film and not have you guys distracted by Bo the whole time I'm filming. So huh, I should have caught my breath. I didn't realize I was going to have to fight him for that, but he's stubborn as I am. And then that jumpsuit. Yo, I believe Southern Yankee got this jump jumpsuit and I loved it on her. And I am really surprised that it looks good on me. I thought it would look dumb i guess i just southern yankee looked fabulous in that jumpsuit and i love it because again texas the weather is off and on here and at some point it will get like cold cold but even when it does i have a plethora of jackets which is why i always say that i have a bunch of jackets i have a plethora of jackets and i love that because that's something that if i went out i could not wear the jacket into the bar or club i was going to you know, park and then hurry my chilled butt in there, but then have a good time, not hold my jacket and just have so much fun. You know, you guys see me like dancing and move my arms around, all that kind of good stuff. I want to be able to do that. So I'm going to need y'all's help because whew, help me Rhonda, help, help me Rhonda. So because I really, I just want like everything. There is one thing I did not try on in the video, and that was the piece of jewelry. This is another Nakamal bracelet. They make, I mean, their bracelets are just, <sighs> this is so pretty. And I don't know if you can really grasp the beauty of it. And let me see if I can turn it just right. Here we go. There it is. The reason I love these is, first of all, I love this design here, the knot. So the knots are so nice and you just fit this little piece here into the knot that's best for you. And what I love about it is you can wrap it tight if you want it tighter, if you want it like loose and you can just kind of decide the design of the way that you're going to wrap it. So you can do all kinds of crisscrossies or if you just want it to be like really like this one, I would probably want it to be more straight and just regularly beautiful. Other ones like my thinner ones. I want them to be, you know, really wrapped and, you know, decorative. So this, I love you. And especially because like these, you kind of, I just tuck them. Like I do a tucking maneuver here with the knots. So it's not so noticeable. Like it's not all sticking out. Cause again, I have a fairly small arm, but so it's not so noticeable. And then I'm just like kind of doing my thing and I'm, I'm like, oh, hello, my bracelet. So what do you guys think of this bracelet? It's so pretty, like I love. I mean, everything but the but the bracelet fits an economical need, or fits part of my closet because I have a lot of jewelry now. I'm, I'm getting to where I'm like, mm, I'm gonna need to pause that glamour jewelry box for a little bit because I'm getting a little too jewelry now. But I need y'all's help. Okay, so let me know if you think this really is a five for five and if I should go for it or if I should pick out some choice pieces and what those choice pieces are. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you had as much fun as I did trying everything on. Sorry, my floor is a mess, Bo. <laughs> but yeah, sorry, my floor is a mess. I keep working on it. 
Today was not vacuum day and I really wanted to make sure I got this out for you or at least filmed so that I could have time to edit it. And so I kind of rushed through it and didn't do all the normal things that I do. So I hope you don't mind my mess. All right, guys, as always, thank you so much for watching this video. And as I always say at the end of every single one, never spend time building someone up who only wants to tear you down. Peace out and blessed be y'all. <laughs>